Hello everybody, my name is Kevin Toe. Welcome to the live stream of part 3 of the horror game called Escape. Escape is a horror game that is free on Steam. It is under development, so it's not a finished game yet, but you can try it for free. And the thing is, let's let's try to make this as short as possible. I tried the game twice in two different live streams that are on here on YouTube. If you want to check that out, you can go do that later. There's a link over here. Uh, and the game is really good. The graphics are good. The gameplay totally makes sense. The controls make sense. Everything is really good. It's scary. Okay, there's a lot of great jump scares. I love jump scares. That's what I do. I do jump scare games, horror games, retro games, but mostly horror games. I love getting shitless scared. But there is a big but in this one. The but of this game is that the monster in the last part that I played is impossible to get away from. You're supposed to collect 10 coins to get out of there to get to the next level or the next place or whatever you want to call it. But the monster keeps chasing my fucking ass down, wiping me out with one shot. You get all these health fish fillet stuff that you can eat to regain your health and your strength, but that doesn't matter because if this monster gets you, you're dead immediately. You can hide and you can run, but you can't run for very long because you got stamina. And the thing is, last time I tried hiding, it's it's like this monster could see me through walls, man. I don't know if it's a glitch or if it's just something that needs some fine tuning, maybe. But again, but the developer of this game, Mr. David Zhang, who's probably gonna watch this video, Mr. Zhang, welcome. With all due respect, I really dig this game. I really do. But it's been a little bit too hard. But there's been a new update because you are actually listening to me, which I appreciate I appreciate that very much. I played a lot of horror games in my time. So I know what I want and I know what a lot of horror game fans want. So you're actually listening to me and you're updating the game after watching this live stream and that makes me very proud being a YouTuber, even not a big YouTuber, I'm, I'm a, like a tiny, whiny, small YouTuber. But I'm very happy that you're actually watching this and actually using this as constructive feedback for updating the game. And you've updated the game again since the last live stream. So it's going to be interesting to see what's different in this time. This is part three of Escape. We're going to start this game up. But first, before we do that, you guys, if you're new in here, please consider subscribing. It's 100% free. Go follow me on social media. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter under the name of Givento. I also do live streaming on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Givento. I do a lot of retro game live streaming there, for example. Um, this is going to be the last try that I do on this game, not because I don't want to try anymore, but because I don't have the time to do this anymore. I need to also focus on other videos for my subscribers. Anyway, putting that aside, let's get started before it gets too late for me. It's almost nine o'clock in the evening and I got stuff to do. So we're gonna do this right now. We're gonna close, no, we're not gonna close. Oh shit, great stuff. Good job, Give and Toe, opening up the browser on your on your live stream let's hope nobody sees the porn just kidding there we go okay horror games escape starting it up okay mr zhang what do you got for me Please, please, please give me something new. Please, please give me something to work with. But if you don't, if it fails, 
fails, according to me, it's okay. Keep updating your game, believe in yourself, but also listen to the dudes that are actually playing the game. I know that you said last time you gotta play a new game, otherwise the new update will not load, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna play it from the beginning, which is totally fine by me. Oh, and also, you guys that are watching this, feel free to leave a comment in the live stream. Chat with me live, that would be so awesome. I reply to everybody, obviously. Here we go, press any key. Alright. Now, in case you missed part one or two, go check that out. Okay, I don't remember that instruction coming there from the first try at least. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this cog wheel. Now, basically, mission objectives escape. It's as simple as that. You can take these fish fillets to regain your strength. You can eat them. Put that cog wheel there to open this door. There we go. See, I'm almost an expert on this now. Turn off the gas, otherwise, you get fried. And I think ah! holy fuck. Yeah, just as I thought there's gas here as well or steam or whatever you want to call it Pick up that coin Let the gas flow Run ah! fuck too early god fucking damn it. that was so unnecessary on me doesn't matter put the coin here To open the door far far away in the back Oops I've been running way too much. Turn off the gas here. And we arrived at part two. Here we go. There's a guy in the scuba suit. Now, let's turn this gas off. Thank you. Open that door. See, I got a routine almost on this part because I really I know exactly how this works. We're gonna go in here where the monster is. We can't do that because we had to solve the puzzle by pushing these buttons with the symbols in the correct order but I know the order by now let's see if we did anything new with this jump scare I know there's gonna be a jump scare okay that's that's good it's the same as last time nothing in there another fish fillet thank you very much we we'll probably should eat one now use there we go very nice going down here crouching and pushing the first button which is there or stone, not button, it's not button. Well, it is a button in some sort of sense. Get out here, then it's the eye, then it's number 13, I remember. And then it's the Pokeball. I call it a Pokeball because it looks like a Pokeball. And last of all, the vagina. Don't judge me. It looks like a vagina. It doesn't look like a V or a T or a anything. It's okay. That's fine. And we made it to the next level. Now this is the part where shit gets real. I never passed this part because the monster keeps chasing my ass down, fucking me up completely. And he's already here. That's amazing. Okay. Let's uh, sneak it up. How close is he? Okay, he's gone now. Oh fuck, he's coming already. Holy shit, hide in the fucking... Really? Well, hello! I saw him this time, but he didn't see me go into the closet. Did you make it a little bit easier, Mr. Zhang? Maybe you did. Now, collect 10 coins or die. Ooh, another fish fillet. Thank you. Unfortunately, that's not going to help me because the monster kills me with one strike. We're just going to have to try and stay out of his way completely. There's nothing in here of use. Oh shit, he's coming. What? 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 He did not see me there. I did not see him, so he can't see me. Unless he has, like, night vision or something, I don't know. Or thermal vision. 
It's okay. We're gonna try it again. I was impressed though that he couldn't see me going into the closet because I it was literally behind me. So that's Yeah, I mean I would have understood if he actually got me there. There we go. All right. Putting in some tobacco here. Hold on. Wait, what? Is the live stream offline? No. The live stream restarted. Okay, I don't know what happened. Hold on, something is wrong with the connection of the live stream. Please stand by. It looks okay in OBS. Why can't I watch myself on YouTube on my cell phone anymore? That's very weird to me. Everything looking good. Hold on. Okay, yeah, okay, it's working, it's working, okay. I don't know what's going on. I apologize. Here we go. Get one coin. That dude. Get a fish fillet. Oh shit, he's here. Oh, close that. That was a close call. That was definitely a close call. He almost got my ass there. Okay, nothing in here. Still nothing in here. I've been in here, haven't I? Oh, shit. My stamina is... Thank you. There we go. That's a lot better. Okay, so let's move forward and let's move in here. What do we got here? Here we go. Another coin. Thank you, my lord. Nothing on the shelf. Oh, fuck. Hide, hide. What in the actual, literal fuck did I do wrong? Can he hear me? Like, with his fucking ears? Do I have to sneak? If I sneak, he's gonna outrun me. Or he's gonna see me. This is getting a little bit frustrating, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. But I know that it's a demo and it's not a finished product yet. Please see this as a feedback, Mr. Sang. I'm not actually angry at you. You're making a tremendous work. I could never make a game like this. I could never make a game at all. I don't even know how to do that. Whew. So I'm gonna be gentle and I'm gonna be... cool about it. But yes, it is frustrating as a gamer with several years of experience of horror games to encounter something like this. Okay. I'm gonna call myself done. Okay, now there's two of them here. That's interesting. Three. Wow, we amazing. Okay, okay, we're gonna do this again. We got three out of ten. He's coming, isn't he? Yep, yeah, hide. He is very close. Thank goodness he walked away. Okay. There's never anything in this room. Why do I bother going in there? We're gonna put the coins here, I think. I think that's what we're gonna do. Once we got them all. Nothing in there, nothing on the shelf. Oh! Okay, he's somewhere... Fuck. I don't know where he is. Run the fuck away. Wait, what? What? That's a dead end. Oh, I thought he ah! fucked me there. Oh my fucking god. Gas here? Really? Okay. You're taking it to another level, my dude. New cog wheels. Oh fuck, he's coming. Hide. Ooh, that's 
He's really close. I'm not gonna be stupid and walk over there to get that coin. When I hear him. Because he's really fucking close. You could probably see me through the bars. Really? He's never ever gonna walk away from the basement? Come on. What? Am I just expected to sit here? I cannot determine... There we go. Thank you very ah. much. Fuck me. He's here again. Okay, that is... that is... that is fucking bullshit. I'm sorry, but that is bullshit. That is... literal bullshit. He did not see me there. <sighs> yeah, I'm sorry. I can't keep... trying over and over again. For something that is... According to me, literally impossible to fucking... Yeah, you know. You know what I'm saying. Anyway. You're doing a great job, Mr. Sang. Keep at it. But please listen to my feedback. Either the monster hears me, which means he can chase me wherever I hide. I have no idea. Or he can see through walls. And... Sometimes it's like he gets stuck in a place, you hear him walking, and then he never goes away. Which means you're just st st like stuck there, you know? So I would appreciate, I would appreciate a little bit easier to get those coins. And I mean, what happens when you get, to, I haven't even gotten all the coins yet, of all these three tries. So when I get all ten coins, do I have to move up to that round statue thing and place them there is he gonna chase my ass down then and then I'm fucked anyway even though I got all the coins I have absolutely no idea great start great graphics maybe tune up the cogwheels a little bit um, great controls there's absolutely nothing wrong with the controls I haven't experienced any difficulty in moving the character around Great jump scares, very good. Good puzzles, I like that. Even add a few more if you want to. But the monster is a problem. These fish fillets, they're good for the gas, or the steam, or whatever. But they're not going to do anything to that monster. We don't even have a weapon to fight with. It's a little bit too hard, my lord. So, this demo is gonna get a total of 7 out of a 10 for me, for being a free Steam demo, that is. Very good, but needs, needs some work. Thank you Mr. Sang for making this game, and thank you for letting me play this, and thank you very much for commenting on my videos, and actually updating the game after my reviews. That means very much to me. It actually means a lot more than you might think. I mean, I'm a small as YouTuber. It means so much. You have no idea. So, before we end this live stream, as I said before, if you like horror games and retro games and reactions, you should totally subscribe. It's 100% free. I'm also on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter under the name of Give and Toe, and I do a lot more live streaming games and retro games, PS1 games and stuff like that on Twitch. It's twitch.tv slash given to. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching and have a great evening. Bye bye.